Welcome back to another episode of the Whiskey Tornado. It is day 16 and it is Thursday, so you guys know what that means. It's Wild Turkey Day and we have got another Russell's pick. This is from Friar Tuck. Um, this is Rick House A. So last week I think we did Rick House F. Today is Rick House A. This is uh, fifth floor. So really excited to try this today with you guys. All right, let's get into it. Mm, nice nose. I mean, every Russell's pick, the noses are just so beautiful. Such a good balance of like honey and a little bit of nuttiness. And then that rice spice, a little bit of citrus on the back end. There's a little bit of that, um, that dusty rickhouse funk to it. Almost like dusty peanut shells. Really nice nose. I'm excited to try this. Cheers, everybody. Man, this was a pick that was picked for the masses. Um, Friar Tuck is one of the um, one of the worst stores in Illinois. If I'm being 100% honest, they charge secondary prices. They're a big chain store that charges secondary prices. Um, and this pick just seems like it was done for the masses. Very like one note, not complex, very easy to drink. Um, this is why I don't buy stuff at Friar Tuck, to be honest with you. Yeah, honey, that's probably the least interesting Russell's pick I've ever had. <laughs> and I didn't taste it until today. And again, I hope it's just that my palate's not blown out from, from all the whiskey we've been tasting. But um, man, we've been we've had a couple days here where I just haven't been a fan of some of these whiskeys. But hey, I always tell you guys exactly what I think. I would love that every whiskey's a hitter. Um, and the great thing about whiskey is you shouldn't take my opinion. Everybody's different. Tastes are subjective. So um, if you guys love this, then th there's no wrong answer. If you love it, you love it. Um, to me, it's just very one note. It's not, it's not bad. This isn't bad. It's just not interesting. Um, it's very one note to me. Let me take another bigger third sip here. Yeah, it's nice. There's honey, a little bit of nuttiness, just nothing too interesting to it. Um, I, I could see if you went on a barrel pick and you had four guys who were kind of into bourbon, but not really. And uh, they tasted, you know, three barrels that Wild Turkey brought out. They all went, ooh, that was the smoothest one. That's the one we want. That's kind of what I'm, in, I'm picturing on this pick. Um, they went for just a very smooth, rounded bourbon that isn't very complex, but easy to drink and tastes sweet. And uh, that's okay. A lot of people like that. For me, I want something a little more interesting. So Friar Tuck, not impressed with your Russell's pick. Uh, still not bad, just not impressed with it. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed day 16. Let me know what you think in the comments. Cheers, everybody. Oh, 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 oh,